a piece of pepperoni. I was kind of. So I know some of you guys are waiting. Clint, <coughs> he has his plan coming up. So what is your your new your next track of your life? Oh. I'm But we're considered Western. What's up, Basil Babes? It's your girl, Joy. And we about to eat this to the tea set. This year's. And we went to, let's see if we get a thumbnail. So I was watching another YouTuber, and she was raving about you want the thing to put on a steering wheel? No. Have you ever used it? No. Do like this, bro. I don't need to use it. And it doesn't come off. That's how I did my other video, but I'll lower this. i lower it, and then yeah, i put it on there. It don't need to be lowered for me. I mean, I guess so. And so, she was raving about the Jersey Mike's Jersey Mike's Philly cheesesteak and ba and baby she made it look good and she said this soda was good so her channel is blowing up she lives in her van and her thing I think her channel is nomadic introvert so I got a Philly cheesesteak. I got the kahuna, which comes with mushrooms, jalapenos, and extra cheese. And see, what did you get? I don't be liking all that extra stuff. I just, well, since, oh, well, I'm not even going to be able to try yours. But Why? Because I don't like mushrooms. You ain't going to taste no mushrooms. You'll be all right. But I got this chicken. Okay, let's see yours. The chicken Philly cheesesteak. You got it. It's good. You better get you one of these. It's Mm-hmm, you better get you one of these. Oh, dropped your bacon, bro. And he loves his bacon. Yeah, they were not playing by my bacon. So, we about to see if it's good. Well, you got mostly bread in that bite, nope. Oh. I'm about to tap the soda. Tap the oh. soda. And we got going for a second bite. It's good. I don't think it was like all that, like you were saying. It tastes like soda. And maybe I'm thirsty, so I didn't really. Mm. good I wouldn't, right be like, I wouldn't be like you you gotta run out and get one of these now but it's good it's good okay so what yours giving mm. Mm -mm -mm. so what kind of what kind of sandwich did you get yeah better get you one of these what is it Better get you one of these, bro. <laughs> uh, it's a, a chicken Philly cheesesteak. Oh, you got the chicken Philly one. Uh-huh. Oh, and I got the regular Philly right. one. Right. Because I wanted to try yours, and then you were going to try mine. Okay. Ooh, baby. She is giving hunty. She is giving, okay? Look at that. Ooh, y'all see that? She's giving. Let's see what she's doing. All right, bro, you better try this before it's Let gone. me get a bite, bro. Okay. Mm-mm-mm-mm. It's good? Mm-mm, you gotta go in for a second bite. You need some peppers and mushroom right there. That's too much, bro. Right there. Uh-uh, bro, you're not supposed to eat two different sides of the sandwich. No! No! Yeah, bro. Mm -mm. Mm. You need jail time for that. Mm -mm. That was the bite. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. 
Mm, that. that was the bite. Mm. Alright, bro. Mm. You better watch out for the bigness, brother. Let me see. Mm. Mm. Right. How do you eat your whole sandwich already? This one looks bigger than mine. Mm. I like mine. Mm -mm. Mm. Mm -mm. This is, I, I just don't like peppers. That's the only thing. I just don't like peppers. Yeah. It's good. I just do not like peppers. She good, bro. Mm, it is. I just really don't like peppers. Yeah. Go on and get y'all one of these. Mmm. Mmm. This right here, this that chicken's out. It's juicy. She got the extra cheese up on there. Ooh wee! Look at that. That's love, baby. That's love in a sandwich. Baby. Good. All right. Nomadic intro. She wasn't lying. I think this is my first time at Jersey Mike's. Clinton's saying was gone. Yeah. All right. Overall review. On a scale of 1 to 10, where y'all drink at? Let me try. Smell good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that drink is it's not that great. The drink isn't, you know, like, <clears throat> you need you to go at, out and get that. You looking at yourself? Mm -hmm. Don't look at yourself. But I'm not. But you know the drink isn't all that. You know it's not like yeah. oh my god I need to go out and go get this drink, girl. Oh my god, it's not. Mm -mm. Mm -mm, but it's good. Excuse me, but the sandwich on the other hand, and I honestly think Jersey Mike's that that's a new thing. Their Philly cheesesteaks are a new thing because if I remember correctly, they only did cold sandwiches and jimmy john's did the hot sandwiches and cold sandwiches so this is new i'm almost sure i'm almost positive and it was really good i probably rated a Ooh. eight out of ten if you've ever been to charlie's charlie's is is a little bit better but that's based out I of philly these are charlie's out of my school yeah yeah charlie's is based out of philly though like they started in philly so I would give it actually not a nine out of ten because it was good. I've never had a chicken Philly cheesesteak. I've mm. only had a steak Philly cheesesteak. Mm -hmm. So the chicken Philly cheesesteak was really good, and the bacon on there was good. It was cooked perfectly. The ranch on there was good. It wasn't too bitter. Like it, they didn't put a lot of lemon or too much dill in there. It was good. It was mm. really balanced sandwich. They didn't put too much cheese on there because that'll make me. I don't like whenever my sandwich has too much cheese. Unless it's sharp cheddar cheese. Mm -hmm. Then I could do extra cheese that they put that on there. Or in like uh, my burrito or something. Queso and cheese. And I'm not talking about like queso, like the cheese queso. I'm talking about like Texas queso. Because queso is a Texas thing. But this right here. You better go out and get you one of these. <laughs> It's good. It's flavorful. Mm -hmm. The cheese is melted. Yeah. And when you get the kahuna one, the kahuna comes with sauteed onions, mushrooms, peppers, and extra cheese. 
and I wanted jalapenos and it's on point it's good mm-hmm yeah and I finished my sandwich fast because I haven't ate I haven't ate yet and it's two o'clock so I've been waiting to eat <laughs> I've been waiting to eat because I was about to leave SD card was full y'all oh yeah I was waiting to eat all day that's why I finished my sandwich so fast but I was waiting to eat all day and she was taking forever. And then we had to go to Goodwill. Then we had to go to the post office. Then we had to go to Africa. And then we had to go to Houston. And then we had, no, nah, I'm playing. We just <laughs> went to the post office and Goodwill. But I was going to go to Torchy's, but she was like, no, I got to go to uh, I got everything, bro. Jersey Mike's. And I was like, okay, I bet I'm going with you because I don't feel like cooking nothing. So we just came over here and I tore up that sandwich. It was good. It was good. Yeah, yeah, gosh, bro. <laughs> bro, I was hungry. And I didn't eat a lot of that pizza last night. Did you like that pizza? No, I don't like Papa John's reheated. I like Domino's reheated. Little Caesars even heats up better than that. Yeah. Like, I was kind of dis... I was like, why isn't the cheese melting, bro? Mm hmm Yeah, and I was like, dude. And then after I took it out, it cooked for so long because I was waiting for the cheese. Then next thing you know, the pizza sauce, like, basically, like, yeah, no. It was just, I was basically just eating bread and cheese at that point. And a couple pieces of pepperoni, I was kind of. So I know some of you guys are waiting. Clint, <coughs> he has his plan coming up. So what is your, your new, your next chapter of your life? Oh, I'm going to Boulder, Colorado. With, uh. With that cold weather? Yeah. What's it called? The weather will die down in March. That's what they're saying. Uh, at the end of spring break, that's whenever the snow starts to melt and it starts to heat back up. It'll get into like the 60s, which is warm for them up there because the highest, it don't get anything above 100 degrees. Like 70 degrees, that's whenever they go out and go swimming. They're like, oh my God, it's, it's warm outside. Let's... They were trying to go swimming while I was out there. And it was like 65 degrees. I'm like, bro, no, y'all are tripping. Like, it is freezing cold. And then at nighttime, it gets down to like 40 degrees. And that's like in the middle of like, I wouldn't say the middle of the summer, but this was right after the summertime, basically, whenever I went and visited. And it was it was cold. And, and it's January here. Yeah. I have a short sleeve. Yeah. Exactly. I'm wearing shorts. If I was in Boulder right now, it would. It's probably 20 degrees right now. Let's see. Yeah, it's 80 degrees in Texas right now. Yeah, you go up there to. Oh, it's not that bad actually. It's not. It's 40 degrees. And what is it here? 80. Oh, it's 80. Yeah, but I mean, 40 degrees. That's not bad. That's that's not that's not like oh my god like I'm dying like it's cold. So why are you going to Boza? I need to get the I need to get up out of here. I need to get up out of Texas. I need to just be far away from home and just do my own thing. Before. What you mean by that? So that I won't be tempted to come back or anything of that sort. <laughs> And I just need to be, I just need to leave because the furthest I've been is called station. That's like 45 minutes away. That's mm -mm. And I just found myself back here literally like eight months after so um, mm -mm. And I hated college station too. I went up to Boulder and I visited and I loved it. I loved it out there So then after that me, Hunter, and Matei's coming with us now. And Mikey, the guy with the curly hair, he's thinking about coming with us. We're all going to Italy. And we're all going for one year. Yeah. Where did Italy come from? Bro, I've been telling you this. <clears throat> now, how you, how you guys going to afford that? It's cheaper to live there than in America. And we get free health care and everything. It's like literally half the price to live here you got twenty dollars in your pockets you eating for at least two days but i promise you i promise you like i have friends down there that are studying abroad and they're like dude like this is like crazy like he's like 
because they were telling me they wouldn't stay here or stay there for any longer than like four years or something like that but it was good to visit and stuff and they stay there for a year so we're gonna go there for a year but hunter wants to go to cape town south africa after and i was like dang bro like why are we going to south africa and he was like, I don't know, like, that's just where I want to, he's been trying to go there for a long time. He wants to retire in Puerto Rico. I don't know why he wants to go to Puerto Rico so bad. He don't even speak Spanish. Well, that's his update. So when you plan on leaving? Next month. Yeah, like a month from now. A little less. I don't know. I still have to figure out what I'm bringing down there and how I'm getting down there. If I'm going to leave everything and just get on a plane and go. Or if I'm going to run a U-Haul. Or I'm going to have her drive me down. Or I don't know. I don't know. I don't know yet. <laughs> but with the roads icy and stuff? Uh, no. Not really. No, it's it's not because what's it called? Whenever you get to Colorado, they already have. I don't want to leave the video like that. Huh? My SD card was full, so wanted to <laughs> close out this video. It was good. So now Clinton treated me to lunch. Now he putting gas in the car. Okay, who he is? Mm. Y'all better get y'all one of these. I got this from Jackie Newton. I like my mug, honey. And the company I got this from is Tomo, T-O-M-O. She cute. You can get the water bottle ones, too. But that's okay. All right, y'all. Give this video a thumbs up. And let me know what you want your girl to eat next time. That was fast. Let me know what you want your girl to eat next time. All right, y'all. Later.